Talk about a game holding on to its value. A 2D Zelda game with an emphasis on freedom of progression so poignant that it actually has way more freedom than the game it's directly inspired by that was known as the Freedom Zelda game at that time. Well, that's not the original. The Legend of Zelda A Link Between Worlds is classic Zelda in all the right ways. Not a single thing about it is complicated. Not the combat, not the puzzles, not the exploration, and yet it feels completely epic and adventurous the whole way through. The idea of renting items from a shop instead of having to find them really does just bust the whole game open. You can spend hours just finding secrets of the overworld without ever setting foot in a dungeon because so many of the game's tools are at your disposal immediately. And the core gimmick of phasing into the wall as a painting is as wonderfully intriguing yet unobtrusive as you want a gimmicky modern Nintendo game to be. It didn't blow anyone's minds, but it's hard to complain about this one.